What's going on guys, Cesar here, welcome to GT Battle Kutoni. Today I'm talking about Nico Balik and this game and how to find him. Not only find him, but I'm also gonna show you how to kill him, you know, how to end his miserable life. So, let's get started. I'll just need a car. Like this one. The limo. And there we go. No, no, I'm gonna pass first, thank you. So Nico Balik appeared three times in this game, okay? And he was during this diamond transfer thing. I'm gonna show you right now how to find Nico and also how to kill him. And this is going to totally destroy the story, you know? I mean not really destroy the story, but it's going to Go, uh, let's just get started. Why was I driving anyway? I mean, I'm not going anywhere. I just like driving in the beginning of my videos for no reason. But anyways, what you want to do is to go into the missions. Ladies half price mission, okay? Then you will go and drive with Tony into the location. Hmm. Should I skip the driving scene? No, I'm not gonna skip it. You should suffer for me a little bit. Or you can, you know... I didn't really get this. Why did they have to send them the diamonds? I mean, what does what what can her dad even do? You know, I mean, the Russians were trying to destroy them and destroy the club. What would her dad do better than this? I mean, you mean to tell me that her dad is more powerful than the Russians? This part did not make any sense to me, actually. This was very stupid. They did not have to go and give two million dollar worth of diamonds to the kidnappers to save a girl they don't give a shit about just because her father might kill them that's stupid because the russians also might kill them so why not be in the safe part keep the two million dollars and be threatened to be killed or lose the two million dollars and also be threatened by other people to be killed that's that was the dumbest shit ever like seriously or maybe there is something i'm missing like Gracie's father is a god or something. He can kill them without even touching them. That's the only option. But other than that, that was very stupid. Okay, anyways, let's go. I'm the best sailor in the world. But am I wrong? I mean, guys, I'm asking you just... Wasn't that a very stupid thing to do by them, by giving the diamonds to the kidnappers of Gracie? I mean, what's the point? I mean, they, ha they had two options, either giving the diamonds to the kidnappers of Gracie and get threatened to be killed by the Russians and lose two million dollar worth of diamonds or keep the diamonds to themselves and get threatened to be killed by Gracie's father who couldn't even do anything to the kidnappers of Gracie and keep the two million dollars worth of diamonds which option is better am i right or wrong and that, that, that was weird and i just wanted to say that i just want to ask you guys what do you think of course keep the two million dollars worth of diamonds and get threatened by this asshole father of hers who couldn't do shit to them it was much better i mean the russians are actually stronger than him that's that's what i think but anyways this. this is the cutscene Wait for the cutscene to end. Should I skip the cutscene? No, no, no. You suffered all this, so let's just survive a little longer. So you want to hand this stuff over? Sure, I'm sure. Father's gonna kill us if we don't. Yeah, it makes it nice and simple. Yeah, it is nice and simple. Lends a lot of clarity to my thinking. Gracie, you all right? Daddy? The 
bastard didn't hurt you, did they? She can't speak. We got a gag in her mouth. No shit. Give her back, you animal. She suffered enough. Hand over the stuff. Hand over Grace. When I first see saw this cutscene in GTA 4, All right, calm down. Both I thought that we put the ice in the middle. We walk back. Then you send over the girl. We leave. And you pick up the stuff. Entiende? Sure. Show us the goods. I thought that he was actually her father and that he was a strong man, but in this game episodes from Liberty City it was a huge disappointment when you find out that he is actually gay and he's not even her father. That was one of the biggest surprises actually. Come back to me, honey. Let her go. Now the Russians are going to come and fuck everything up. The diamonds are going to be lost in a truck full of sand, I guess. Right in the heart. Go, go. Fuck. Oh. Now concentrate on this part. In order for you to find Nico Belik and kill him, once you get the control of the boat, look backwards, okay? Look backwards. and go back and it is very important here to not look forward because if you look forward Nico is going to disappear right away now get off the boat and jump and there we go here is Nico Belik now what you wanna do is uh, he, so we found Nico Belik now let's go get a gun and let's do this don't worry about the cops just shoot him okay I'm sorry Nico but I have to do this you know I mean I hate you I don't hate you actually you are one of my favorite characters the character I actually hated in GTA was no no don't go there don't go yes yes thank god ah there we go I killed uh, wait 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 come on and there we go I killed Nico Bellic that's not your day Nico is it but you made a lot of mistakes in your life so, may your sins are forgiven. But anyway, so yeah, that's how you find Nico Balik in this game and that's how you kill him. Thanks for watching, I'll see you guys later. Bye.